Question 9. So very similar to the previous one, but on this occasion we can't just rely on symmetry from the start. We do need to get another value so we can power a few up. So I've taken x being 2 and substituted that in. So 2 squared minus 3 lots of 2 add 1, which I've done over here gives us minus 1. So we've calculated that value in blue and now we do have the symmetry, minus 1 to minus 1. So there's the ripple. So the 1 matches with that 1 and that 5 matches with that 5. Plotting gives us the smiling face and taking our two readings we get about minus 0.8 and 3.5. Question 10. Now just popping this round um, the other way around so uh, reordering the second the two terms on the right we've got minus 3x plus 1. So the gradient is a minus value so the line is going down yet it is crossing the y-axis at a plus value so it's shaped like this it is therefore E. Uh, the reciprocal graph always looks like this, and uh, this is a smiley face graph plotting, uh, cutting the y-axis at plus 3, it's a smiley face, y-axis above, above the line, so that's got to be I.